Yeah, so we knew the first half was just going to be a battle, and, and we knew the second half the game was going to open up, and sure enough, it did. You know, after we got the first goal, uh, we had numerous opportunities to bag in multiple goals. Do you find, feel like you're still trying to find the connections out there and find, uh, you know, find ways to replace what's what's gone missing with uh, Marcelo and Landon leaving? You know, uh, it's tough those those two uh, key players leaving, but uh, we've been training the whole preseason without them, and um, also uh, it's just the first game. You know, so we're just catching rhythm, and we want to catch form early, because uh, you know what we're like when we're catch form. Yeah, but you get that familiarity, right? The, the experience to manage these kinds of games. Even yeah, so yeah. Better, right? uh, a lot of veterans on the pitch, um, as far as our team, you know. So that that really comes into play when it comes around the 75th minute. You know how to kill the game off. What did you, you, you think of Jose's performance over there on the left side? Uh, I love Jose out in the left. You know, I felt like he played a phenomenal game and a great goal. How important is this year for him to kind of make that leap that you did last year? Um, it's very important, you know. He, as you can see, you know, he started his first game, and uh, a, one thing Robbie Keane told me is, once you start, you want to keep that starting position. So, I guess the same thing for him, you know. Once he starts out on that left wing, you want to keep that position. Have you spoken to him just any wisdom, just to impart? Uh, we always talk, you know. Jose helped me out. You know, he's been playing pro longer than me, so. Uh, we always uh, communicate, you know, that's my boy.